You want to make your best, straightest, most powerful throw in the game? I'm Sam Perlazzo. I'm here to tell you how we're going to do that today. It all happens with how you grip the baseball. We take it for granted when infielders make a play and they come up and make the good, powerful throw to first base, the strong throws from the outfield. They do that by gripping the baseball across the big seams. So these are the big seams, the distance between the ball, that's the small ones, and that's with the seams. So we always want to try to get the big seams. That gives us the rotation of the ball coming out like this and gives us our straightest, most powerful throw to the first baseman. All right, so how does that happen? Well, it happens really quick, but I'm going to slow it down for you. The ball goes up, comes in the glove, the fielder reaches in and comes out and does not have the seams. Well, in slow motion, as he's coming back, he's going to rotate that baseball in his hand until he gets across the big seams of the ball. Now, does he do that all the time? Absolutely not. One of the high choppers, bunt plays, guy comes in, grabs the ball and has to get rid of it. We, we take what we get. But on the, all the balls that are in our area that we have time, you're going to see the fielder catch the ball, reach in without looking, and spin that ball and come up with the big seams. He's going to go up, reach in, spin it, big seams. All right? Very simple. You can practice this at home. You don't have to do anything else. You don't need any players with you, no friends. Just throw the ball up in the air. Don't look. Reach in. Turn it around. You got the big seams of the ball.